Hello everybody, my name is Parak, and in today's video I was asked to go use the charge blade against a Garangom. So today I put on my spinning axe charge blade build, because these arms don't get particularly weak enough to actually use the uh, element exploit, and as well as a lot of Sayed's damage is just from element and he doesn't reach those points, so I'm better off using a raw focus build with some element. Of course I'm using my attack boost 3, element exploit 1 with 3, 2 slots. And here are the skills and decorations of course, all these green numbers here are from decorations. This time I did slot in a little bit more damage through the effect of offensive guard. I traded my jumping for it because I feel like I'm going to use morphing advance more to move around than jumping. Alrighty, let's go. So first things first, I'm going to swap scroll because I have counter peak on this one so we can get our shield buff, which gives us more damage as well as our spinning axe off it. It'll be nice and easy, just because I don't have like load shells and stuff, because it's not all that needed on this. I feel like you should be able to get it back pretty much every time. Like by the time you finish spinning, you should be able to get something back. There we go, get that one going. You should attack again. Slam, thank you. Bruh, really? 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 <laughs> that, there's no shot that I should have missed, but that's okay. Right, now we're in this, get quick ready stance for, I don't know, I don't think offensive guard activated on that one, unfortunately, but that's okay. Slam, there we go, quick spin on him. That and a lot of his openings are a little bit too fast for Sayed to land, because you'll basically trade every single attack, block both of these, ED1, okay, another slam, try proc offensive guard, oh, I don't have enough guard for that, that's unfortunate. So I guess I'd need embolden maybe? Nope. I'm pressing buttons. Okay, game. Thank you. Okay, at least it's not holding that today. Because uh, that was frustrating. I tried to go over to him and then ready stance and it just did nothing instead. But that's okay. What are you doing, lad? Slam. Spin. There we go. Nice and easy. Okay, I really wish there was a way to see the uptime on offensive guard. But there's just no way without mods, unfortunately. Okay, nope. Keep Roll to keep our axe. Where you going? Ah, just short. There we go, spin on him. Nice and easy. As you can see, we're already at red as well. So, very, very quick to get your vials and whatnot for your next reload. Okay, he missed again. That's fine. That's all good. We should definitely go the face if we can. God, I don't like that that beats my guard. I guess I need a tiny bit more for that then. Like, maybe the... I don't know, maybe embolden in here as well, if I'm playing solo. Should be enough. We're probably going to fail the damage check, because I feel like we're not doing a whole lot. Which is unfortunate, because I've been hitting him fine. It's just not doing a whole lot with the hits that we're getting. Which is fine, it happens. At least having a decent enough time with it. Spin, okay. Nasu. Say it wouldn't beat it either, probably. Like, there's almost no reason it would. Okay, that's fine. Oh, we did beat it. Okay, go over to him and B. There we go. Get that spin going. Try to get over to the face if we can, because it's I think it's his best raw hit zone. As well as, you know, his arms aren't glowing, so everything's kind of a bad hit zone at the moment. But that's okay. Just spin away while he's tired. Block that. Forward. Nice. Ooh. Another one. Yeah, as you can see, it's almost like the perfect speed for this fight. God, that's painful. Oops. Actually, I should have gone into... um this. But that's okay. I had Intrepid, so I wasn't worried at all. And he's tired, so we actually get a chance to punish that anyway. Just wait for him. He's sweeping. Shouldn't hit me. Okay. I was blocking just to make sure, because I can basically spam Ready Stance indefinitely anyway. Maybe if I Morphing Advance instead. There we go. That'll work. I just gotta be careful about getting stunned off it. Ah, it's unfortunate. All good, though. Does he head swivel? He does not. Okay. Block. So we keep our guard, or keep our spinning axe ready. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, was that intrepid? I think I just got it back in time. That was so lucky, actually. Block that. Roll forward, so we keep the axe. What are you doing, lad? Oh, backing up. Roll forward, so he misses. Morph advance under him, into a spin. Quick spin. Okay, he didn't do anything out of it. That's fine. I'm glad he interrupted me, actually. There we go, just ready stance that, get some damage. We're also building up extra vials from the, uh, what's it called, from blocking things, so it's completely fine with me. 
Hit in the face as well. Lovely damage. On yellow as well. So we should be able to charge our shield again. There's the stun from using impact. Spin into another one. Nice and easy. That was actually really good timing on that stun too. Very, very nice indeed. Okay, nice. Probably one more. We've got Entrapped, so I'm not too worried. Morph advance through this. Oh, nice. Good timing for that. I'm spamming circle, but that's fine. Just decided to do nothing. So good. And get some more damage. I probably should have just gone like a, a blast switch axe instead. I do have one set up. So we could have definitely done that with spinning axe instead. Please do what I input. There we go. It actually did it. We've broken the face as well. I don't think this build has... Yeah, it doesn't have Heaven Sent. Because we're down to white. I've got Intrepid, so I'm fine there. Keep spinning. Got to wait a little bit. That's fine. i got my shield back. Block that. Get some more hits in while he's tired. He takes a long time here while he's tired, as you saw earlier. So we definitely take advantage of that as best we can. Roll to the left. Okay. Nice. Down swing over to him. Nice. We morphing advance through this. Turn it around. Okay. Nice. Move forward a little bit. Cancel it early. Into that. There we go. Yeah, I don't even know if I've used or like activated... Um, what's it called? Um, offensive guard in this hunt. I think I have at some point. I just don't know where. He should go to do the thing. Head swivel? No head swivel. Okay, that's fine. We morph. Guard point. I did not input a regular swing, but that's fine. There we go. It also speeds up that animation there with the shield. So, yeah. The normal swap is a little bit slower than normal, for sure. There we go. We just wait for the two hits, because there's two hits on that, as we've been blocking it recently. Morphing advance through this. Into spin. There we go. Cheeky 1300. Not too bad. Quick one. Into a block. And then we do more. We should have ready stance back. As you can see, we just gotta wait. Should be able to walk away from that attack, I feel like. That's why I trusted it there. Started on top of me. All good though, we can ready stance and swing. Don't know what's happening, I can't see anything. But that's okay. Oh my god, not so okay there, but that's alright. Nope. That's hit me so many times now. Big slam. There we go, spin off it. Nice, ooh, another one. Okay, that's probably it for there. Block these. Only did one. Right. Nope. What? Hmm, okay. I I'm glad what I'm inputting doesn't work half the time. I really, really am. Okay, that's fine. Please don't stun. Perfect. There we go. Again, probably fail damage check soon. It feels like I'm doing very little, in all honesty. But that's okay. Another one. Oh, nice. He didn't hit me. Slam. Thank you. Wait for the two hits, of course. You can hear the ting, much like the Lance video the other day. You can actually hear when the block starts. Or, like, when the block goes off. So you know to keep holding. Nope. Or time your insta-blocks, in the case of Lance, at least. One, two. There. Okay. Yeah, that's a damage check. Uh... Well, I did go to block with Ready Stance and nothing happens. Delightful. But that's okay. As I said, I do expect to fail damage checks with this. It just feels like we're doing absolutely nothing to him. I don't know why. It's like a regular build. It should still do plenty. But it is what it is. We also got hit quite a few times there, so that might have been a factor. Wait for it there. Okay, nice. Get some more. We've got Intrepid Heart. Luckily I didn't lose it to that dumb attack, I would have been quite upset, but that's fine. Upswing real quick, because we have to block this. Head swivel into raw. Quick spin. All of it missed, that's fine. Yeah, as you can see, I've been getting hit way too much, because we don't even have our red vials here. Mmm, okay. Fantastic. I'm so happy about that. Come here. Oh, perfect rock. That'll work nicely. Guard point, so we do some extra damage. Hopefully he gives me something decent instead of this garbage. Don't know why he chose that of all things, that's so fine. Just do it all manual style. No. Okay, probably activate 
spin off this. Okay, there we go. Now we can swap. Block one and roll under him. Okay, there we go. Finally on the roll again. My god, why is he spamming this? Stop! Why is the AI sometimes like this? I don't understand why they made it this way. Really, really don't. But that's okay. Maybe? My god, please. My guy. He's done that, what, three times in a row? Next he's gonna do the nuke, right? Okay. Nope. There we go. Quick spin on him. It's finally blue. It didn't even take that long in all honesty, it's just... He's just started choosing garbage so we couldn't beat the check anymore. Bro, stop! Morph under him just to make sure. Go forward with ready stance, ED1. Block that. Two hits once again. There's the damage check, go over to him, spin on the face. Nice and easy, get another one. And another one. We've got a stun off this as well, beautiful. We were very close to building our own stun there apparently, because that was almost instant. But that's fine. Get another one. Yeah, this is what I meant about the offensive guard uptime. I feel like it's so inconsistent not being able to see when it's activated. Because, for all I know, I didn't activate it at all there. Yet, I know at the start I would have at least once. But yeah, there you go, there's Charge Blade with Garen Golm. I do recommend using Spinning Axe over the uh, Sayed because his arms are just terrible hit zones for the element. And obviously Spinning Axe can land damage on a lot of his openings as you saw. Well everybody, that was another requested hunt, this time fighting the Garen Golm with the Charge Blade. As I said, I recommend using Spinning Axe on this one because his arms are the only good elemental hit zone and they're not even high enough to actually hit most of the time, being like a 15 hit zone I think, something like that. As always though, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you on the next one.